Hello everyone, this is Prashant Chaudhary. I welcome you all to my channel. In this video, we will be configuring the Dataverse search. Dataverse search, it's a feature in the Dataverse. Sometimes you might be stuck in a case where you know your items, your data, but you know, don't know in which table or list your data is present. In that case, Dataverse search can help you there. Earlier, this Dataverse search was used to call as a relevance search. Okay, so in this video, we'll see how we can add the Dataverse search in our all model driven application and how we can add the multiple entities or table in the Dataverse so that it can search our data. Okay, so let me take you to my screen. So uh, here I have on my Power Platform screen, I have some official documents for the Dataverse search. These two links I'll add in the description of this video. Okay. So in order to enable the Dataverse search, you need to come to the advanced settings, advanced settings. And in the advanced settings, not in that, sorry, I'm sorry, not in the advanced settings. I just go to the admin centers, admin center. And here in the admin center, we also need the advanced setting. Okay, so I have already opened that. In the advanced setting, just go for the environment in which environment you would like that that our search to be enabled. Okay, so we go to the environment, select your environment, and here in the setting sections, you have the product. In the pro inside the product, you have the behavior feature, language privacy and security. Just expand this and search for the feature. In this feature section, you can see here we have the Dataverse search. I have enabled this on by default, it's it enabled. Okay, so you can just turn it on or off as per your need. So let's first your work should be turned it on. If it is on, it's good. If it's turned off, you need to just turn it on. Okay, once you turn it on, a search bar will start appearing on the top of the all moderable applications. Okay, now your work is to add your list so that it would be searchable. Okay, so come to the advanced settings and here in the settings you have the customizations. Inside the customization, customize the system. And now our work is to add that list or tables for our search bar. Okay, so just click on the entities and on the entities here you can see the configured dataverse search just click on it and here you have all the list of entities that are present in your dataverse and here are the list of entities that that dataverse search is actually using okay so you need to just add those entities as well so let me just open my one application more different application so i have one application so here I have this search bar at the top and here I have two different entities. Okay. So let's open the domain data. And if I would like to search for test, this test, I'm just trying to search for. So if I write test, it is not finding any record because this entity is not configured with this global search bar. Okay. We need to add this entity or multiple entities to my global search bars. So come to the this screen and enable those entities so my ent entity's name was dummy data so i'll write control f okay, and write dummy. okay so dummy data i need to just add this and the data table 2 here you can see in the multiple application i'm also adding this as well okay and okay So it takes a little time sometimes. Okay, not every time. So now my two entities has also enabled. Now it is already enabled now. So now I try to search. Yeah. Okay, so let's try to search. working right now okay 
so our work is to like we have added the customizations we have okay okay now just go to the solution in which solution you have added these 200 days okay so i have a solution demo app in this solution i have added these 200 days okay so inside the solution i'll just go to the overview okay overview is that one we click on here you can see in the tables i have these two tables in this solution okay so i'll go with the overview and in the overview you can see we have the database search okay so just manage the search index click on manage search index and add these two these two is already configured okay so this is my application Let's try to search again. Okay, it should work. Sometimes the system takes a little time to reflect the changes. Okay, so yeah, it has started working. So now you can see if I search for tests, I can see these two main records in the dummy data. In the first table, I have these many records that are messed with mystery that I have passed in the search bar and in the different table as well. I have this test too. If I click on this search more results for this, I can see the results here. The top results depending on the table name and you can also get the table here as well. Like how many records you have and on each entity you can see showing six records based on one field. If you would like to see which field it is, just click on this and it will give you the name. Like on the name field of this table, these strings are matched actually. Okay. So if you would like to filter, you have the filter options like on the modified date, created on, or, or the owner, depending on the owner, you can filter. Okay. So, yes. Yes, guys, this is all about the Dataverse search. The Dataverse search has many more capabilities as well. You can search and uh, find the more capabilities and try to explore it. Okay, I have added I have added the link of the official document from the Microsoft of this uh, Dataverse search in the description of this video. Okay, so I think you find this video little helpful, not much, but little helpful. Okay, and if you have any queries or if you have any doubt, you can just I try to contact me i'll try to uh, give you the answer okay so thank you everyone thank you for watching this video thank you